hello friends uh, hope everybody is doing well so today i'm going to show you how to extract a uh, uh, saved result from the cpc 100 as you can see we have a cpc 100 here what we have to do we just uh, have to turn it on the power you can see this is a power button turn it on and we need to wait for some time to power it on so as you can see it's powering on <clears throat> Excuse me. So meanwhile, it's finishing. So let me show you uh, how we can extract uh, extract uh, data, uh, saved the result data from the CPC hundred. So here we need to put click OK. Yeah. So first of all, we need to uh, configure uh, the parameter on this one. So to this one, we need to press this one okay and then we can see this is a device setup in the device setup we have to go in network so if i scroll it down you see i can change the value but we have to use this button there we go and this ip so we need to set the ip there's a two type it's auto ip and statics i'm gonna select a static static ip and then here you can change the IP as you want. So I put this IP. After setting this IP, so you have to apply change. Here we go. Apply change here. So the IP is set. Then we have RJ45 connector to be connected here. As we can see, I show you this one. You see the support. This RJ45 connector. The other one you have to connect in your laptop and then in the laptop so you have to open this omicron device you should be installed in your laptop click this one you see refresh this one and before this one what you have to do you need to go here in the network setup and then change adapter options and then here, go to property. In the property here, then you have to select this IP. The PC IP and this one IP has to match, as you can see. So 192.168.257.252. Here I have my laptop IP, 192.168. 127253. So hit click OK and OK. Now you see we have established the communication. Then we close this one out, this one. Then we'll go here in the Omicron devices icon. As you can see here, we can see it is connected. Just double click here. Here we have all the result. So this is a log file and result. This is a test results. So this is one of the site we have here. So this is we performed. Once you click, so this will this menu will pop up. Okay, and these are the value. So different uh, like, uh, the card I set up the different card. So what you can do here, you can see each test values here in this part. And even you can rename, if you want to rename the card, you can see. But I don't want to rename that one. So here, what you're gonna do, so test card, assessment, if you want to see the, you want to mark as assessment okay or failed, you can assess here, this menu will change here. Okay, you can see here, if you double click here, and let me show you card. This is a test card you can use. You can insert a new test card also. If I open it, 
Okay, let me show you this one. So, as I was showing, if you need uh, this uh, result in form of uh, tested support, just right click, you see, display test report. So, the reports will be displayed like this. As I can show you, you see, you can scroll it down. You will see all the result. Yeah. And, but, and if you want to export, here's the option. You can export a print. You see, there's a print option. So I can print in a PDF, or you can send a printer. So you can do whatever you want. Even you can open with the this ms dos ms word sorry yeah even you can do the setup here as you can see the page setup if you double click here sorry then you can open is uh, open with the cpc editor you go here you see the cpc editor is open here you can rename and like uh, assessment is result is okay or not okay you can put assessment like uh, if i tag insert card you can insert card as well and i do my assessment also like uh, here i let me show you the one assessment is okay you see it's mark okay this one if i said assessment is okay or not okay or failed i can assess this one you see already so so guys this is the way we can extract saved value saved file from the cpc 100 by using this one so please let me know in your comment how do you find this video thank you stay safe